surprises we have planned in the show. I will just say everything in the show, in one way or another, is connected to hair. <laughs> My first guest is known for gorgeous hair and gorgeous everything else. They are the most followed family in America, and they're coming to the Big Apple. But the drama started on the finale of Keeping Up with the Kardashians. <laughs> food in this green room. It's good, right? You know, I had such willpower today. They brought in these homemade churros, and churros are my favorite things of life. And oh. I said, I hate to be rude and turn down oh. food, but you have to take those out of my room right but now. But it's a compliment. <laughs> it's a go-to Sherry. Uh, what tricks are we going to learn with beautiful Sherry here? Well, we're just going to talk about dry scalp. So there are lots of great products on the market to deal with the dry scalp. You can get them at, you know, drugstores or, or beauty salons. This one is uh, Fido. So it's just a scalp treatment. And you, mm -hmm. What you want to do when you're doing a scalp treatment is just take sections, but start at the top and work down. And you just apply directly to the scalp, right? And then you just keep going down the scalp like this, right? And do you do this before you hop in the shower? When you get out, I, I would do this matter. at night, actually. Do this at night. Do this at night. And then the soak. thing that a lot of people do is that when they do a, a treatment, like a scalp treatment, they'll start rubbing their scalp, which is, it just irritates it. So the way that you move product on your scalp is just to massage the scalp. It'll Gently massage, massage your scalp. Exactly. Now, so that I will see treat that you also have my olive oil over there. We do. Is that product placement Because or what? if you, you know what, <laughs> a, a simple, you know, people have olive oil at home, obviously. Well, another, I got gallons of it. Another great treatment for the scalp is just olive oil, put it in a, ke in a ketchup bottle and apply you the same way. You cannot believe, I, I, I've learned since we started this show, my mom used to actually rub olive oil on her feet to keep them soft in the yeah. winter. I've learned so much about olive oil. It takes off sap from the Christmas tree. Mm -hmm. and Really? This, yeah, and who knew it was a scalp treatment? Scalp treatment is good for the skin, good for the hair. And well, oh, thing, baby, oh. If you're lucky enough to not have a dry scalp, something you can do every night. You remember that old sort of wives' tale about a hundred strokes before you go to bed? Yeah. It really does work, and the reason it works is because it moves the oil that's naturally on your scalp no to the ends of your hair. So to protect them. So just strokes at night like that from root to end and I like to specifically use a paddle brush uh -huh. because it doesn't pull the hair it won't pull out the hair but it's enough to move the, all, oil, the oil down down because it's a, a, a big surface though it doesn't pull on the hair that's a down. great tip so it's really really great, great tip very easy nice. <laughs> okay <clears throat> Lori what's Lori Hi. gonna get here hi Lori how are you I'm great Lori's got this little fun card that's don't do that color. No. Don't do that. No. Don't go there. So what are, you, what are we going to learn with Lori? I love this trick because uh, like the biggest complaint is hair is looking dull. In the middle of winter, hair can be very dull. A midwinter pick-me-up for the hair is to get a gloss at the salon. Oh, I love that. I've had that. Yeah, it's perfect. It's, it's a very specific treatment you get at the salon. It's similar to having oh, a single process done, uh -huh. but it, you don't add color, right? Gotcha. So it uses just enough of an of a, a activator to open up the cuticle of the hair and it puts shine right in and you get a really amazing result. Yeah. Another trick that you can do though is you can find a color that matches your natural color right. and have your colorist add about half of that color to the to the mixture and half uh, no color. So it gives your, does that make sense? Yeah, it just bumps up. It bumps what, it up. It's not just the gloss, it's like half gloss, half your own natural color. It gives your natural gives color a boost. Boom. And you get tons of shine, and it makes a huge difference, and it's a lot cheaper Her than having a single process. Her hair looks incredibly healthy. Yeah, yeah, it's amazing. Does it feel great? Oh, it feels great. It like moves like, you know, so She looks so like a hair commercial. She looks like a hair model. <laughs> <laughs> Inexpensive. Yeah. It's fantastic yeah. and it's inexpensive. I don't know if you heard Kai say yeah. that. And it took under an hour, well under an hour. Under an hour, that yeah. is a key part. <laughs> now Kai is just starting to thaw us out. Up next he's going to show us how, I don't even believe this, but I want to see it, how to avoid cat head. Yeah.